everyone, welcome to today's video. Today's video, we are going to be testing out the new CoverGirl True Naked palette in the color Sunsets. This is new. Um, a lot of people, they had like, I think they had four new palettes. One was like, it smelled like peach, and one smelled like chocolate, and then the other one, I don't know what it was, but the, the colors for this one were the ones I liked the best. That's why it's like, I already have a chocolate palette and a peach palette. I don't need another one. So, I just got this one because I like the colors. And, we'll get rid of this. Okay, let's get started. We are going to start off with, I think they're all, no, they're not all mattes. But this one here in the first hole looks like a mat. Yes, this one is a mat. So we're going to start off with that one. The only thing I don't like about these is that the pans are so skinny that it's sometimes hard to get a brush in there. But it fits, so it's not, it's not as bad as some. I think the one that was the worst was the Gigi Hadid palettes. Their pans were just tiny. I don't know what they were thinking. Anyways, I'm just going to put this all over the lid. And it seems to be pretty nice. It's very powdery. I see the powder flying around. But I don't mind powdery as long as it goes where I want it to. Okay, for the next color, for our transition color, I think I'm going to go into the next two are shimmers. And then there's that dark red one. I think I'm going to go into that next one. That kind of mauve colored one, right? There. And use that for our transition color. So, let's just go in slightly. See how dark this color is. Well, it's not bad. Kind of pretty. I need a bigger brush, but this one was clean. It just takes And I'm going to put it about halfway across my lid. The color seems to be going on really nicely. See how it blends with the other colors. But it went on really well. Okay, now I'm going to take the same brush since it was kind of too small for the last color anyways. And we're going to go into, well, let's just see. Ooh, look how dark that one is. Those are almost the same, huh? But this one is pinkier. That second one is kind of more purple. So we're going to go into the pinkier one right here and put that in the crease. And we're going to start in the outer portion, since it seemed like it was so dark. I hate that when that happens. And then we're going to go on the lid with it a bit. Of 
we're going to do kind of a halo just because we can. Well, it seems to be blending really well. Not getting a lot of drag. That's good. Drag's a drag. I'm going to take my little pencil brush with just a little bit of that darker color that I've been putting on and put it on this outer portion and pull this up together. Kind of smoke that corner out a little bit. Draw that up. Then I'm going to use the same brush, take some of that off and get that lighter pink and just blend that out a bit and go all the way across. Now I'm going to go in with, I keep looking down and seeing this thing and thinking I've got something spilt on me. <laughs> it's not. I'm going to go in with this shimmery shade right here, the second one. It's, it's a light, 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 light pink. And I am just going to stick that right in the middle. And I'm going to spray my brush with some X Plus. Did you see that? Just whacked that magnet right off there, didn't I? There. Sometimes I don't get very much Fix Plus on my brush because I can tell that it's barely even wet. But it worked. Well, it still blends well and it looks nice. I'm just taking the brush that I used to blend the edges of this everything together. I think it looks pretty good and it for a cover girl it's blended really nicely I am going to go off camera now put some liner and lashes on and I'll be back okay guys I am back I put on some liner and lashes I used Gigi Hadid liner um, the pencil liner for my push lining I used my NYX Epic Ink Liner for my wing. I have on Ardell Wispies. Um, I did have to change out my lipstick because that other lipstick with this bold eye, I did have to make a lighter lip. So this lip is the Vivid Hot Lacquer from Maybelline in Tease. I really like this. I like the color. I like the looks of it. I just sometimes feel like, I especially sometimes feel like I get it on my teeth. Actually, I think I do get it on my teeth, but you can't see it, but I still feel like they're dry. I didn't do that today though, luckily. I was careful. So, um, I think that this CoverGirl palette is getting a thumbs up from me because it blended really nicely. It, it's great. It, and I was, you know, I'm not a big CoverGirl person, so I was not, you know, I like my Milani palettes. And I would not necessarily say this is better than Milani because I like the, just the whole 
palette better. And this was like $10. And the Milani palette was $15. So I would go with the Milani palette. But this one did blend really nicely. So if you're a CoverGirl fan, this Sunset, that's the name of the, that's the colors of this one. Um, it blended really nicely. I would say that probably the, the, the formula is good. So probably the other ones do too. So just pick the color you like. This one was the one that I liked the best and I thought I would use the most colors out of because the chocolate palette was like all browns and the peach palette, I already have the peach palette from Too Faced, I have the chocolate palette, so it's like, eh, I didn't want those, but I wanted to do a video on it, so, and then this one and then one other one they had were in with those two, but these don't smell, which I don't care, I don't care if they smell. I don't care if they do smell and I don't care if they don't smell. So anyways, I'm giving this palette a thumbs up and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Follow me on Snapchat, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Share this on all your social media so that we can have lots more people join the party. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys so much for watching my videos and I will see you in my next video. Mwah!